Business news now and the Ecoleni municipality has unveiled the highly anticipated Aerotropolis master plan. During a two-day conference, the plan was unveiled to local and international investors. With me now to talk more about this, I'm joined by Ecoleni's executive mayor, Monli Gungubele. Very good afternoon to you. Thank you for coming in. Good afternoon and good afternoon to your viewers. Thanks for the opportunity. Well, first of all, tell us about the plan for the Aerotropolis and what makes Ecoleni feasible for such a venture. We host uh, the busiest airport in Africa, mm. capacity 23 million, but operating at 18 million as we speak. That airport also takes 90% of the cargo carriage in South Africa. Uh, also, Eguruleni has, uh, it actually is, in, is, 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 is hosting the railway hub of Africa. If you look at Jimistin, Jimistin connect Africa to Maputo, Africa to Durban, and that makes Jimistin the most strategic uh, shunting station. But however, the, the master plan is a product of us as a city crafting our niche because of the role of the airport economy in the globe as we speak. Successful other countries like Memphis City, Hong Kong, and so on. So that master plan is a product of an 18 months planning, okay. which combined, it was led by a consortium, led by Oricon, international experts and so on. What happened is that it sort of reveals huge opportunities mm. that lie in the city, which actually gives us an opportunity with the private sector in 30 years to produce a city which is totally different from the kind of city we have as we speak now. So if I jump in there, the, the huge opportunities that you talk about, I mean, this, this is an opportunity to tackle joblessness, to take on poverty, mm -hmm. um, essentially repositioning Gauteng's economy. Oh, yes. Um, and, yes. And, but then how do you balance the distribution of, of the economic activities that are going to come out of this venture? Maybe probably it's important to say the, the airports today, they, they are used to leverage connectivity. Mm. As a result of that, in industries that trade in light industrial products, time-critical products, perishable goods, if an airport and its logistics is organized in a very efficient manner, such industries tend to build around the airport yeah. because the type of products they are producing helps them to connect efficiently between customers and suppliers, provided the airport is better organized. Now we know, together with AXA, in particular ORTAM Airport, how best to work together, us and them as a city. The other key issue is that, if you look at Gauteng, Gauteng leads in high-tech manufacturing. Throughout Gauteng, the master plan of 25 years that Gauteng has put together for a seamless movement in Gauteng, creates conditions of all those industries that actually manufacture high-tech products to actually use the airport, also to improve their connection with their customers nationally and globally and regionally, as far as you can say. Now, once those industries are pulled in there, opportunities for work, because listen, the master plan ensures that Eguruleni has, has demonstrated that Eguruleni has got opportunities in four hubs, mm. and those four hubs are widespread in the city. In the north eastern side, you've got uh, a tech uh, de development and research uh, sort of hub, and then in the north, you've got a recreation hub. There, you've got a lot of industries that are there, and it also indicates that in that historic situation, what kind of catalytic projects? So we've got about 29 catalytic projects that we're selling, which others avail themselves to pure private sector investment. Others avail themselves to joint uh, public and private sector sort of intervention uh, investments. Now, while I've got you here, something completely different, but Ekuleni has also been in the news for uh, the Wi-Fi hotspots that you've launched across your metro. Tell us a bit about those. How have those taken off? You know, thank you so much. Also, Eguruleni has come to the party yeah. <laughs> on this matter. <laughs> um, Eguruleni um, has got a, a vision to become a fully connected 
digital city by 2017. Uh, the, we are rolling out a, wife, a, a, a broadband infrastructure, but in the meantime, wherever we have actually connected, we are putting Wi-Fi. We uh, are going to need about more than 600 uh, sites and there were 3,000 hotspots. But so far, we've been able to connect about 215 plus with 921 hotspots in a various townships through particular buildings. Now, what we were doing yesterday, we were launching the work done so far. And what was actually exciting yesterday was that even before we promoted, already 88,000 even before promoting it, we're already in use mm. of what is existing. All right. Uh, mm. That's Sekuleni's Executive Mayor, Monli Gugubeli. Thank you very much for coming in. Thank you very much. Thanks for the opportunity. In. Well, staying on the business track, we're now going to take a look.